Attacks are going in. Uh, not a huge amount has happened right yet. Yeah, yeah. Um, this is the finals match of the weekend tournament. And sorry about the delays. But, um, yeah, we had some difficulties getting the match started and getting our cameraman in here. But this round is actually live already here on Hard Rain. Uh, sorry, I'm Prodigy Sim, and I'm here with Justin Bieber. How are you doing? I'm doing wonderful. But, yeah, um... This is the Holla Holla Get Dollar vs. El Gigante finals match. And it's already live, so we're just gonna get right into it. Boom getting popped right here. High Dollar taken out to the side. Open field shutting down the jockey. And I believe the hunter... No, he's still running around. Already halfway through the map and pretty much no damage has gone out so far. Yeah, really great shutdowns from Holla Dollar. And it looks like they're untagging right now. It, the lineup for Hollow Dola is Rook, Nirvana, Dusty, and Parsnip, which I believe is Steven. Against El Gigante's Audio, R2, Puff, and Shade. And I do believe we have War Rooms available. Tank coming up. Oh, actually landing a charge right here in the back. Spit gets blocked by Dusty very handily. Nice spit block by him. But let's oh, take no. this to an El Gigante War Room. Needed you to get that charge guy, man. Fuck no. Do you still looking for me? Okay. Looking for me? Ah, oh, you're good. Reloading. This is passing. Oh god, no. What? Me? The guy was? It's just. Don't fucking miss your punches. Let's go in, R2. Call for help. Let's go now. Wow. Someone else is gone? I said let's go now. You should have boomed someone out. That was like a thing was going for. He's already down to help on us. Welcome back everyone, and that was El Gigante's tank. Uh, pretty damage mitigation right as he went in, but you know, on that final commit they didn't land a boom, and SI seemed to not really get the greatest of caps. Tank was only able to get that one in cap on Rook who was already chipped. So uh, very well handled by Hollow Dollar though. Uh, yeah, only having one in cap, their health bonus is still sitting at 576, which is pretty nice for this first map. That is, but they have a pretty good setup for this, they have a charge spit. It is a 2-2 two two, though, so, and we already have a pause going out. From Holodala themselves. Uh, also we just had Breaker join us during that, during that war room. Hello Breaker. What up? So yeah, three-way casting tonight. Uh, let's see. I guess we already did a roster rundown, so we're just gonna have to wait for this pause to go through. Oh, pauses. Anybody have any awesome shout-outs for us? That'd be cool. Since we're all bored and watching a pause screen. Yeah! You know, I have to say, um, one thing I've started doing lately in pugs and scrims on this map is trying to fight the tank out in the in the open field over there, like across from that house that you normally take it under. Yeah. Throws that one off. It does throw him off and the thing is like if you can dodge the car like once, unless he gets like a really high speed car or something, or somehow you get boomed there, it's pretty I mean it's pretty easy to ace the tank there. So it's it's sort of a riskier move because the car can be in play. But if you get like four people in green permanent health, it's it's a really great move to go for, I think. But I don't know, yeah, sort of risky. It's risky, but it's smart play too. Yeah. I'm just thinking of the score like five hundred and seventy six health bonus and thinking, you know, if uh El Gigante wants to beat that score, they need to do something like that. I think you can afford to take a little bit of risk, especially on map one of uh hard rain. I mean map one is almost never a game decider, especially in hard rain, so... Yeah. Oh, I mean, the middle two maps hardly ever have a big difference in score. 
And the first map can a little bit, but it's only if like one team gets wiped can it be a big difference in score. If you do have that lead on map one, it's really easy to keep. Yeah, that's certainly true. But then again, anything can happen on two and three. I feel like two and three are, like, team-wise, who show, who's doing well. And exactly tank, location, tank location, too, has a huge part on map three. I mean, you can you can actually make map two and three if, if the tank spawns in a good location to take it, but... Yeah, I like cutting people off on two and three. What a long pause. Wow. This is extremely long, and neither neither one of the teams is saying anything. There's like nothing to talk about yet because nothing's really happened. So, you know what I think we should start doing is like during long pauses, we do like surprise war rooms, where we like switch into the war room and see what the hell the team's talking about during the we pause. We should do it. We should start right now. <laughs> okay, it. okay. Go to high dollar war room for like do it. thirty seconds or a minute and come back. Your girlfriend pregnant? What? What? Shit. Do this shit. I got an abortion now. Gross. Gross, 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 gross. That happened to me one time. This sucked. But hey, some guns abortion. Here. Had to take the GF to the clinic. We cut through this garage sale. Alright, welcome back everyone. That was our pause war room. I have no idea what went on. SI spawning up the front, getting a pull on the Dusty actually. It gets cleared. Will this charger get the charge? It does. Cleared very quickly, but that spit's gonna land on him. Ooh, actually getting a nice amount of chip right there. He did double boom landing as well. Very nice quick hit from uh from El Gigante, but I think that might be their last real hit for this map. Yeah, and uh Hollow Dot Hollow, they're still sitting at over five hundred points of bonus here, so pretty large. I really want to call this team like high dollar or like high skill or something, but it's very hard to tell. Hollow doll just is so hard to pull off my tongue for some reason. <laughs> oh, hit going in, actually landing that pass for a good amount, but uh, Charger and Jockey both getting ripped to shreds. I'm not sure if that spit actually got any damage on there, but um, Dusty is now in the yellow. About 20 more off their bonus, but it's still really large for stage one. Yeah, so they got like almost an extra 100 points off after that tank, which isn't too bad. That's about what I think you should expect. It's pretty average. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this health bonus in general is a pretty average, uh, we survived the tank health bonus. Yeah. So now it's time for El Gigante on Survivor. You didn't grab the guns? Me? Who died and made me gun monitor? Did we notice who was sniping for uh, Team Holodollar? Was it Nirvana? It was or Nick, Steven? whoever was pulling him. I didn't see who was pulling him though. I think Rook was Nick. Well, I don't know. We'll have to see on the next maps what happens. Who's that weird <gasps> character person? That's Steven. I'm gonna call him Parsnip. But what? A parsnip. I think it's a vegetable. Piece of that or I made it up. I think you made it up. It's possible. Two two openings set up right here. Um we didn't see El Gigante get a lot with this opening hit. Wow, Shade is being impatient. Uh, why wait? <laughs> I think Shade's East Coast, doesn't he? So this is pretty late for him. 10 p.m. on a Sunday. What you mean? Yeah, it is. Kind of list. I'm waiting on Nirvana to ready up. I think he's getting beaten on. It's possible. Hmm, maybe we need another surprise war room to find out what's going on. Yeah, go to a dollar war room. Yeah, let's do it. Move your 
damn ass. No. Welcome back, and the round is now live. Shade very happy about these pauses, but obviously, Jackie going in, getting dead stop quite quickly, and batted away, but a pounce of spit does actually land onto R2 in the back. Only a total of 12 damage, but we did have this boom here onto Audio Gamer. What happened to Shade? I don't see. I don't know what happened to him. Maybe he just got friendly fired. That's a lot of friendly fire damage, and that's what that was. See, uh, he took more damage than the hunt spit did. Surprising. Yeah, indeed. Let's see. Sniper is sitting on Audio Gamer right now. They've managed to take this choke point before spots came up. Very nice, quick moves. Yeah, I like taking this choke. Yeah, that's a good move. Whenever you can make that happen, um, a lot of damage can go out on that choke point. So being able to take it out is pretty nice. We do have a 3-1 with a spitter here. No smoker. Setting up their SI from three different directions. Looks pretty good. But that hunter seems to be a little bit far away. Not sure what works is doing there. Looking like they want to go right here right. instead of Keep down the middle. Go to the house better. They're going inside, and it looks like they're just going to actually sit inside and take it through here. If this charger can get a spawn on them, it could be bad. But no, they take it outside. Rook getting chipped a little bit. Goes and lands a 12 damage pounce onto audio. Jockey getting juke around. He does land the jock. Lots of charger punches going to pull in on Dusty right here. From Dusty's jockey and that charger onto R2. Huge amount of damage so far. Wow. Yeah, almost an end cap onto R2 actually from the charger punches. Ooh, Shade putting down a pause. Maybe he's going to sub out R2. No, no, no I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't think he'd do that. Oh! R2 oh, has yes. to go. <laughs> Who called it? Oh, wow. <laughs> I wonder if he like actually has to go or if that's like a I'm subbing out R2 thing. I feel like it would be improper to do a uh, surprise war room right here on El Gigante. So we're going to avoid doing that. But uh, who knows and we'll have to see who comes in in his place. Yep. I'm R2's out. From Easy to Briz for playing Minecraft during this match. Briz is playing Minecraft during the match? Yeah, during this. <laughs> wonder who they're getting. Uh, maybe they will be getting Briz. I don't know. Too busy playing Minecraft. I don't know, Minecraft is pretty fun sometimes. Getting Briz! Oh! Wow, you're like two for two tonight, Prodigy. Freaking. <laughs> 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 Telling Shade that he's playing Minecraft. It's like the other team is. <laughs> is that Briz as yeah. Grape? I didn't realize that was... I didn't realize that was him. So yeah, it looks like Briz is going to be taking a slot. Briz, of course, another standard Sinister player. Uh, taking a place of R2. You know, I wonder if we're going to see the Sniper get handed off from Audio to Briz. I doubt we'll it. We'll have to see. Well, you know, this may just be the time for uh, El Gigante to go Let's big, as is their namesake, and uh, try for some aggressive tank play to keep from taking any more damage. Yeah, the health bonus is going be aggressive. Go ahead. They can really be aggressive now. They should. My chair. Yeah, dude's going to have to be bleeding during that tank, and so... It's trying to be. All oh, right, Briz, of course, gonna be aggressive during that tank. Gonna be bleeding, so yeah, if they can be aggressive, they can reduce the bleed. 
620 health bonus, so they're ahead by about 150 on that front. But, um, yeah. If that tank gets, like, anything at all, though, it's gonna be the complete opposite. Yeah. It really will be. If it's just concentrated on Nick, then it doesn't really matter. Yeah, once they get Nick down, then they'll be, like, 100 points ahead, maybe 75. But if they start getting some more punches on other people, like, if they, if they can get another in cap, they win the map. Or, yeah, Hollow Dollar will win the map. I just noticed we're, like, seven seconds away from a, a natural horde as well. Are they going to be able to spawn that tank before the horde comes in? <laughs> I don't know. We'll have to see. I wonder what's taking so long. We did just see Briz load in, I believe. Maybe somebody's AFK. Probably. Yeah, that and there's more conflicts going on in the sinister war room that we are not pretty. Here. Is this one of the longest pauses I've seen in quite a while? Not as long as the CSN pause. Finally going live again. Oh! Indeed, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And natural horde. And, wow, they just barely stopped themselves from spawning that tank. Gonna take out the horde first. Um, Briz has already pilled, though, question mark? Yeah, that's what I'm looking at. That's, because no help. that's broken. <laughs> hmm. Nice proxy boom on the coach. Not really sure how that uh, pill pop got cancelled. <laughs> We're gonna pretend like it didn't happen though. Jockey getting taken down quite handily by R2, but wow, two cap in the back right now. That charge is gonna get some damage in onto audio. Reloading. Gotta reload. We can cut Tank so. I feel they should play the sink right here where they are. Oh, wow. Almost landing a Moonwreck. Well, yeah, they just have that one car up front. Trying to get some picks onto him. Looks like the sniper has been passed off onto Briz. Um, let's put this into the Hollow Dollar War Room right now. First, but I'm dying last anyway. Nah, I'm bad. Ah. Nice punch. Pass. Try to get out, I'm taking more ship. Nick's still on you, DHR. I'll try to get a boom. I'm gonna have to go in with this. I'm ready. Okay, go in. Cover support, we need it. Go to help. Shoot it! Shoot it! I got two of them. Fuck, my bad. My infected is derpy as fuck right now. I'm at two, let's in there, I signed a little earlier. Oh. Welcome back, everyone. That was Hollow Dollar's tank. Um, really nice aggressive play at the start, getting like 1300 chip into the tank before he could even commit. And then just got focused down very quickly. That double boom went in, and I was kind of afraid they were going to start. Losing a lot of health, but uh, they managed to kill off the tank so quickly. Tank and now it's spreading up. One punch onto uh, Briz, I believe. Ninja sword here. Yeah, it looks that way. Rochelle, two punches. Oh, two. I think one onto Ellis. Either way, their health bonus is now officially below 
uh, hollow dollars. Hit going in, charging, and a whip right there on the inside. Double, triple boom landing inside. Um, along with some spit damage, along with that pounce onto audio, he's down in the red now. Still getting scratched and popped on by that boomer. I feel yeah. like that attack was maybe even a bit early, but they still got a lot of damage out of it anyway. Yeah, they just kind of got a uh, smash together inside that house with the. Uh, the charger went first and it was basically a distraction, but it worked really well. <laughs> 328 health bonus right now. So, yeah, about 160 points below. Nice landing in the back, gets cleared though. And the rest of the SI basically just making the survivors slow down and bleed a little bit. Charger can't find a spawn at all. Two survivors sitting at door. But the SI are going to come in now, Charger moving in. Oh, actually lands on the puff on top for 10 damage. Looks like Briz just cut that tongue off the smoker. Yes. Uh, nice moves right there, saving himself from a 2 cap. But a pretty good amount of chip anyway off of that hit. 252 health bonus. For El Gigante. Nice job by Holodala making this map. With, uh, yeah. Oh. 200 more points than their competitors. I hope this game stays this way. Like 200, 100 point game difference. Yeah, like yeah really. Shame not to be a close game. You know, uh, Hollow Dollar did beat off. <laughs> did beat hard to kill to get to this point in the tournament, and uh, that's a pretty that's a pretty good accomplishment for a team like this. Yeah. So it'd be possible to see them take this tournament. But you know, I think Shade's gonna have something to say about that. Yeah, they've been playing longer. They know what they're doing. This this kind of deficit really did, won't affect them that much. We'll just push yeah, it to better. Sure. We'll have to see what happens going into map 2. 2-2 uh, two, two setup for whichever team's supposed to be uninfected. Both teams, not really sure who's going to go spec and then switch. Alright, Rook giving in. Puff switching over. I like doing that. <laughs> it's a mind games of uh, Left 4 Dead 2 ready up. See That's which another 2-2 two two setup here at the start. Yep, absolutely. Hunter, Smoker, Boomer, Spitter. They're probably going to want to lose this pretty quickly. Yeah, Looks like Hunter's setting up for a wall kick on the inside. Boomer wants to fly through one of these windows, I think. Looks like they're all going to pile in in that second hallway right there. Yeah. Hunter spawning up. Not going to make it through. Spit has already been used. Blocking the survivors off a little bit and actually managed to get two points. Boom gonna go in, lands onto one. Pole not yet going in. Uh, Coach trying to push it right here, Dusty takes it out. Hana not gonna land, does actually land onto Dusty. And Spit once again delaying Rook in the back. So a very long and drawn out hit, yeah. I got a little chip out of the 10 points of damage. Yeah, not too bad for the setup, and they're gonna have... They should have spawns for, like, as soon as the survivors get into this next area. There is a witch is up a ahead as well. They're gonna take her right now, but he's missing. HR, yeah. Missed quite a bit. He's gonna have to reload soon. Jockey going in. Oh, not gonna get laying, but a 5 damage pounce in the back onto Rochelle. Witch taken out before he can get to that sniper. Actually, he got no lucky. damage going in. Yeah, he got lucky. He missed, like, four shots before he actually did anything to her. Yeah, good attempt by, uh, El Gigante, but really nice shutdown from Holodala. Who is, uh, Ellis? He's playing HR. That's, that's Steven. Oh, okay. Parsnip. Next hits here. 3 one there, no charger. Smoker getting taken down very quickly. Hunter Jockey coming in from the back, not able to land caps. Finally getting dead stopped and shut down. Somebody got one point, probably a spitter. 
Yeah, they ran through the spit a little bit, but... They could push this tank if this tank spawns right here. But the tank could cut them off right here. Really great shutdowns by Holodala again so far. Halfway through the map now and still pretty much no damage. Yeah. Looks like a 2-2 setup here and they have to start thinking about this staircase choke point. And tank. Yeah, this is looking to be a really, really late tank spawn. All survivors above 90 health right now. So Boomer and Spitter both getting popped. They'll probably get another Spitter. Survivors may want to try to push this choke while there's only two spawns up. Smoker pre-spawn in there to try to scare them off a little bit. Just a few more seconds and Briz and Shade will get their spawns. Uh, they do get a jockey and a boomer, so not too bad. Oh, Smoker going for that pull, not gonna land. Survivors getting baited. Yeah, these survivors are really baiting as hard as possible. Audio with that charger getting chipped a little bit. This is gonna be a long choke point. Rochelle trying to. Oh, bunny hop, <laughs> boomer in there, getting the sniper. Smoker not able to get a pull onto there. All the SIR spawned at this point. But uh, nobody's committing. Smoker actually repositioned to the charge. Looks like they're going to try for a, a charge back off here. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Oh, Jockey going in. Not able to get out. Getting instant late at the end by Rook. Oh, wow. Pull actually getting wow. cut off. Charger oh, nice. manages to charge down onto the next level. Dusty somehow taking a huge amount of damage from that, though. Yeah, that was. And tank is now spawned, so um, looked like it was gonna get He's shut down. He's stuck but in the elevator, bad. actually. So they're not, I mean, <laughs> the tank is stuck in the elevator. Yeah. What? <laughs> so they're gonna have to start the event, or the tank's just gonna die there. Wow, is this serious? That's unfortunate. <laughs> Good job, Prodigy. Good job. Mm, this <laughs> may need a restart round or something. <laughs> Shade saying they're in a big surprise for when the event starts. <laughs> um, Tank passing to Puff. Trapped in this little prison. <laughs> yeah, I, I think they're gonna... I don't know what they're gonna do about this. I have a shout out from Brazilian to Prodigy. Fix it, fix it, fix it. <laughs> so, I don't know, this run might just end up being played without a tank from either side. Getting that jock onto Dusty for the end cap though. This AI tank's gonna die pretty soon. I don't think he's gonna stay alive right there. He sh well, the stuck suicide time's super high in Confocal. <laughs> I think they are gonna have to hit it. I don't. I'm not sure if this tank's gonna die. SI still going in. Survivor's still playing. Rook took uh, a lot of damage. I didn't notice when that happened. I think they could kill the tank as he's coming up. They could but even just set this. Hit goes in now. Charger not gonna land right there. Quick shutdowns on all the other SI. I Charger think they could just it. peek over the edge and snipe the tank if they want to sit there and be risky. Yeah, but SI will kill him. And he has about 50 okay, health. Tank is not coming up with the elevator. He's not? Oh, what? Oh my tank god. Tank has been wow. about 500 points. <laughs> Bio going in on the tank. I don't think the commons can get to him, though, so this is just silliness. No. <laughs> nice jockey <laughs> off the side on the Rochelle, right? I don't understand what's going on here. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of cap. pull damage on the coach as well. Oh, Jockey. I don't- um, what is going on? I'm so confused. Tank is not getting hit. <laughs> He's just what sitting is, in that what elevator. What- what- what's gonna happen when the elevator goes back down? Like... Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. They- They're doing the right move. Holodala is just trying to shoot it down, but honestly, this isn't- I'm not sure this is really what's supposed to be happening. Hunter and Charger going in for the separated Sniper in the back right here. Sniper able to shut down the Charger. 
But uh, quick clears on the hunter as well. I actually want to see what happens I know, I if want they to, go down. I want they to are going to try to shoot it. Happens, but looks like they're killing it. Oh, the smoke is going to pull off. No, he should pull forward. Oh, Dude, they're yeah. going to get charged right here. It's going to be so bad. It's like, they're all just sitting there on the... Go like, down, it's going to crush him. Aw, oh, that was shade. Yeah. Telling you, they should have done a restart round. <laughs> but the smoke should pull forward. That would have been funny. We'll let El Gigante make the call, I suppose. I don't know what the survivors are doing. Oh, going back for ammo, it looks like. This so they're going to have to take this choke point again. Really interesting. <laughs> they're the same setup as last time. Yo, Not too bad then. Looks like sur survivors bleeding out now, so they're probably going to be a little bit more anxious to take this. Oh, Boom, gosh. actually landing a ledge cap onto Dusty. Oh, Jockey landing in the back, but not getting oh, a ledge cap. Yeah. Pull landing down as well, but Jockey does get cleared. Charger managing to land on the bottom. Almost. In the meantime, out. Dusty's actually going to start getting hit by these commons, if they can figure out how to navigate to him. Unfortunately, they keep jumping off the ledge instead. <laughs> Smoker does have a new pull, if he can find a way to use it. The hunter no. should go right now. Oh, oh nice. wow. Wow. Very nice Maybe double cap. Now. Boomer. Oh, oh. Boomer almost getting a stumble off on the Rook as well. Dusty Jockey gets that. Go. Dusty, yeah. yeah. Getting that pickup on Dusty. Another Witch Cap. Triple Witch Cap! <laughs> Jockey MVP right there from Shade. Oh, can he do the third one? If Shade can get this final cap, it's going to be a Smoker brag video. But no. Smoker wow. finishing it off. Nice job by El Gigante. No tank and still managing to wipe off that amazing <laughs> choke point hit. No tank, no problem. Wow. That's absolutely right, Shane. Now this is where you can take your lead. It absolutely is. Uh, plus, they shouldn't, have, they shouldn't really have a tank to fight themselves. But, uh, you know, I mean, Holodolic still could do the same thing. You know, get a wipe on the event or get a wipe on that ledge or maybe charge them all <laughs> off while they're chipping the tank down. They're gonna need something huge, that's for sure. Frizz asking if they should kick the tank. Uh -huh. I think they don't want to spend the time on that ledge shooting the tank. Well, they're pretty upset of that wipe. Yeah, Dusty makes a good point. They did have to take like five attacks while they were shooting that tank down. So I think it's uh, they should basically have to shoot the tank down themselves to about two thousand and then have it kicked. That's tournament admin, but do team. What? <laughs> Why are they asking me? I don't have anything to do with this. Raz, what do they do? <laughs> Amare pointing out that, uh... Hall of Dollar wouldn't have had to go back and get ammo if they didn't have to uh, spray that tank so much. Very <laughs> interesting point. Well, they could have just smashed the tank with the elevator. I don't know if that would have happened. I mean, the tank went through the elevator once. But the round is live. Getting a nice quick pounce spit on the front. Oh, spit not actually spreading very well. A uh, total of 14 damage. 13 damage. Nice boom. And a double boom. Which is actually going to get some good chip, it looks like. Or at least a little bit. I like their 3 1 witch shotguns. Shade rushing witch right now. Not it's bad, not bad, as long as he doesn't get hoarded. Yeah, he's going to have to stop. Jockey's up play on this. And getting the headshot onto the witch. Missing a few shots. 
which is coming in is will this jockey land no he's gonna get stopped nice pounce landing in the front pull in the front as well which still moving getting taken down though but uh the witch actually shift. saved the two cap that's certainly true yeah kind of interesting but uh more damage than we saw El Gigante get off of that which uh, still not huge amounts though. They do have three shotguns, so they should be able to power it through anything right now. That is what shotguns are made for. Powering through maps. I'm a reload. Huh. Reloading. Rass said Reloading. just shoot the witch down to 2,000 health. I don't know if the witch has that much health to shoot down to. Bieber. Or the <laughs> That's what I meant. <laughs> hey, I'm reloading. Reloading. I'm so tired. 3-1 with Boomer here for this choke point. Well, looks like you want to hit inside, maybe? Although Smoker and Hunter both setting up on the outside, but Boomer and Charger are so far in front. I kind of have to wonder what's going on. I guess it's just a uh, different direction play. Hunter going in. Oh, getting dead stopped by Shade in the front. Charger going to go in with the Smoker. Not going to land the charge, but a boom does go down, along with a little bit of Smoker chip. And one final punch onto Briz. So El Gigante uh, shutting down the attacks very well. A little bit more damage than uh, all the dollar had taken up until this point. Yeah, but uh, once again we're seeing... Uh, yeah, health slightly lower, but really high green yeah. going into this uh, Ducatel Sugar Co. High Rise, should we? Spitter going in for a sack. And Boog in a sack as well. Actually landing the boom on the shade. Very uh, matrix boom. Curving bullets. That's not matrix. What is that movie? Where or what? Where somebody's curving bullets. Oh, I think it's, it's like wanted maybe. That's oh yeah, that name. wasn't. Hunter gonna go for DP here totally. Maybe not. He's not part of GCM. He can't do it. Uh -uh. <laughs> Pretty good setup for the stairs here. Yeah, um, getting a pounce up top and then getting the charge off of that is always a good move. If you're survivor, a uh, nice way to shut that down is just uh, not kill the hunter <laughs> until the charge is dead. But we'll have to see. Reloading. They do have a spit with this, no boom. Jockey going in, getting dead stopped by Shade. Nice bait right there. Charger actually landing a two cap with that hunter in the back. Spit going down. Oh, not able to get puff off that ledge, but an okay amount of chip. Tank spawned up in the elevator in the hands of Parsnip St Steven. I must wonder if this tank is gonna maybe go up with the elevator instead. It is going up the elevator. Oh my god. It's because he's not an eye. He's not AI, that's why. Wow. Uh. <laughs> Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> that's not I don't know what to think about this. I think Are they just gonna? Honestly, I think this whole round should just be restarted, probably. But. Yeah, I really think they should have restarted it as soon as this happened the first time, but... Oh, boy. <laughs> wow. AI oh, tank AI is gonna off. come up, so, like, they can't just shoot this. <laughs> He's on the boom. Boom is landed in. Charger's gonna come in, get some punches on the coach. Nice double, charge. Double charge right there. Tank sort of fighting with everything else. And actually a ledge cap on the off. audio. Oh, well. What is AI it doing? <laughs> can't navigate to the wow. moon survivor. <laughs> doing the moonwalk through the map. Oh, Rock gonna come in and not land at all. Oh yeah, I think. No, no, kick out. Just go down. <laughs> oh, he's gonna be stuck right there. He's stuck. Oh, That's this true. game is <laughs> so wow. I don't even know. <laughs> um, so, El Gigante.
very high health bonus managing to not get wiped on those strip points. Especially during that AI tank. Yeah, this can't be good for uh, Holodola. I don't know, that map was just such a cluster. A cluster funk. Oh wow. So crazy. They should really have just like thrown that out and restarted, but okay. Really great setup for Holodala for this field attack here. That is true. Survivor's bunching up. The Charger needs to get in there though. Pole goes down but gets clear. Ch Charger just gonna go for some punches on the audio. Getting a double charge at the very end there. Nice amount of damage from that charge and a great quad boom. Coach actually gets end capped from Common. Back up very quickly though. Dusty probably gonna go for this pull while they're still in the field. Maybe preempting his teammates. But the sniper should be able to clear that. Gets cleared very quickly by his teammates with the mouse too. Stop one smoker right behind them. <laughs> yeah, really. They need to get this final hit here really quick. Hunter gonna get punched before he can even finish crouching. We were trying to boom through a closed window. And double boom going in, but it looks like El Gigante is going to make it in with 400, nope, yes, 380 points of health bonus here, putting him to the lead of about 250 points. <laughs> How about learn to play the game? How about learn to restart round? <laughs> I, I like how they don't take my suggestion to restart round, but then when they need a call later in the map, they're like, let's see what Prodigy Subast to say. Oh, okay, guys. Wow. That last round, I'm still just... That was good. Yeah, that was, that was cool. All good right, game is good. <laughs> that was... <laughs> I've never <laughs> seen that tank swan that. That was almost as good as the Hunter last yeah, night. Yeah, I'd never seen that right there. <laughs> yeah, the Hunter with the uh, coaster oh, yeah. last what match. Is that what you were talking about? Yeah, yeah. What happened? That was so funny. Oh, you should... Oh, uh, this next round is starting real quick. We'll talk about it after this hit. Looks like Hunter just sacking, actually. Spitter probably going to sack as well. And they're just saving up for a good hit in the field. But no, it was a dark carnival match. Uh, I'll upload like a clip of it to YouTube or something, but this Hunter pre-spawned before the coaster hit on Dark Carnival 3, and like he spawned up before the coaster went up, and so he had to like just book it. He was like running on foot away from this coaster. He couldn't pounce away or anything. It was amazing. <laughs> Smoker pull actually not landing for some reason. I didn't really see. Yeah, Hall of Hall doesn't really get a, a field attack here, so... If we're going to save for the top, and they do have a, uh, actually they don't have a charger, so hopefully that next spawn, actually can't get one because they already have three cappers. Mm -hmm. So they're they not going to have a charger for this. Not looking very good for a Holodala. Spitter, Hunter, Jockey, Smoker, wow. They need to wipe El Gigante on this map, I'd have to say. Well, I mean, they can always come back on map four, but... Just to keep it close. They need to they need to pick things up right here, I think. Hit going in. El Gigante is already dropped onto the back. Smoker gonna get taken out very quickly. Jockey does land. Hunter, oh wow, just barely missing a pounce onto Briz. Really shouldn't have missed that, but uh it does land for a little bit of ship anyway. It's better want some scratches. But gets shut down. Storm coming in as the survivors move through to get some ammo. A lot of coming behind them right now. Oh my gosh, the storm is so loud. Yeah. It is. <laughs> yeah, survivors just waiting out the horde. 3-1 again. Almost the exact same setup except uh, Boomer instead of that spitter. Really not a power setup here. Hunter's gonna go in. Jockey two cap landing. Oh, Hunter taking the jockey's target though, unfortunately. Smoker does get cleared, but uh, okay amount of chip on the shade off, off of that hit actually. Yeah, a lot of damage on the shade. He's just getting pulled and hit by commons. Yeah, he is down to 58. 
and it's going to be a pretty light tank. I'm, I mean, El Cugante has a good amount of health, but it's going to be interesting to see what they do with that. Tank has spawned into the hands of Parsnip. Um, can we take this to a El Gigante War Room? Survivor War Room. Let's go. Let him go for me first, I'm low. Oh, God, I mean. He's here, he's here. Down top. Look for Boomer and stuff if you're not HR. Reloading. Don't go back there, go back. No, no. Let's... Hold. Riz, you got me? Nice. Charger's up still. Kill this tank. He's got nothing except that charger. He should be dead. Let's hit that. Okay. Thanks, Dave. Let's move. Welcome back, everyone. And that was Holodala's tank. Uh, it almost looked like they were going to be able to get that quad cap there, but, you know, I think the SI just didn't really get their timings together so well, and there was a really nice level near the end by Briz. At full health level, that trigger had full HP pretty much. Yeah, it was like point blank, he wasn't even like already running, so it was just a uh, miracle of timing and aim. But yeah, still a good amount of health on these survivors. Pull going in onto Briz, but the other SI don't really have spawns to go in on this. Boomer gonna get popped. It looks like they're just, I mean, they're sacking at this point it looks like, but it's not really what they should be doing. Jockey gonna save up front, Dusty. Yeah, this is another huge health bonus for yeah, El Gigante. So much, so much bonus right here. 684 is what they're sitting at. The tank should have cornered one instead of gone for spread. Yeah, he was having trouble getting that corner. Oh, actually oh, getting a jog oh. off to the side, so a huge amount of damage. It looks like maybe Shape got stumbled off as well. Yeah. Charge lanes up top getting a good amount of chip as well. Wow. All of a sudden, like, three green survivors are now four red survivors. That was like 200 health bonus right there lost in that attack. Yeah, really good moves. Um, but there's still a bit of permanent health left on each of the survivors, so unless they can get some more chip on in the last, you know, five seconds of the map. They made it. Oh, Spit going oh. in! Oh, we're wow! Sure. Briz deciding to try to go for a level on that charger, eating a lot of damage. Not quite getting in cap though. <laughs> Just barely managing to stay up. Almost another 100 points off their bonus and that's door attack. I think that was a full 100. They were eating pills before. They were up at like 420. So, wow. Uh, Wow, so much damage there, those last two attacks. They lost half their bonus in the last two attacks. <laughs> Nirvana asking if they're playing Finale. Okay, everybody <laughs> I do not think go. so. I got one. Let's get How many hours of this well. game? Still <laughs> <laughs> Finale's broken? <laughs> 2011 broken Finales. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I noticed the yeah, Xbox yeah. players made a yeah, petition yeah. to fix the Finales <laughs> on the forums. And there were a bunch of people commenting like, wow, isn't that kind of sad that we have to have a petition to ask for a bug fix? What do you mean, fix it? Like, make it work again? Yes, make it work again. Oh, okay. I missed this going finale. in with uh, all the SI, putting in non-cappers last, good moves, uh, only getting 5 damage, mostly from Spit. <laughs> Another scratch. Shade giving out a shout out to R2, no hard feelings, he says. I'm sure it's a heartfelt sentiment. Jockey, yeah. Smoker, and two spawns coming up. They should suck. Yeah, they've got a Hunter again. Reloading. Looks like they are going for scratches with that Hunter. Oh, are they going to leave him up? They yeah. are going to leave him up. <laughs> wow. Are they going to kill him like last second or something? No, he's just going to stay alive with 68 help. Oh, wow. Brit is putting out some BM here for not having his Hunter killed. He's not happy. He should really just despawn. I mean, he's not going to get anything doing this. Yeah, he will. Oh, wow, he managed to avoid getting hit. Reloading. Reloading. Holodog's looking to take the staircase uh, from the normal direction, Reloading. it looks like. They'll get screwed. They Should've might, yeah, that way. boomer can go. 
Boomer, oh, actually gonna get pop. Pull, landing, but not gonna get a ledge. Oh, actually, two survivors falling down onto that little ledge. Nice pounce actually landing in the front there from Briz. They so that's 68 Hunter. help Hunter. They should have killed Hunter. Hunter. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, Steven sitting at 47 HP. So a little worse off than we saw El Gigante. Which can be disastrous for this tank. We'll have to see. Survivors trying to push through this horde right here. Uh, it's pretty much taken down, but they do have a nice new two with the charger for this hit. Triple boom landing. Charge gonna land in front with the jock oh, wow. in the back as well. Oh, nice pound nice. spit onto Dusty. He may it's actually go guy. down. He does not. Wow. Just barely staying up. Oh, they shoot him down anyway. Good job, Brooke. <laughs> Probably the right man. You should take Kana and just like side swipe the Yeah. Thanks. They probably should have wow. tried to keep him up until the tank. Closer to the tank anyway, but. Yeah, after that attack, it's, I mean, getting past the tank is going to be really difficult now, I think. Right, they can bleed with this tank, but no, they're just going to keep hitting. Nice two cap landing. Three, Three cap, cap actually land, but the pounce in front has been cleared. Lots of scratches and damage going in. Nirvana and Rook down in the 50s in terms of their health. And uh, Dusty finally committing his pills. I don't see any extra pills for the survivors anyway. Um, and the tank is now up. There's not. Let's go to a Holodolo war room. Hear him try to hit. Hey, block spawns for me back here. Sun rock. I, I'm hoarded, I can't uh, clear you. Rock. I'm gonna take my pills when the tank comes in. Yeah. Did I buy one? Sure. Yeah. Just be sure to kill him before the horde dies down. What the fuck? I'm gonna be down. I can receive it. I think that's a wave. Nice, nice. That's off the hunter and the charger got me right while I was doing the hunter. Bad. Welcome back everyone. That was El Gigante's tank. Uh, not bad moves by Holodala. They kited that tank around really well for a long time. Killed off a hunter. Um, but they just couldn't dodge that charger and then the tank finally started getting some punches. So they are still alive. And they just got a nice boomer pop. I'm really so, surprised that boomed in the land actually is like right above them. Yeah. Perfect timing, dude. Hunter, Smoker, and Spitter up right now. The survivors basically just going to be getting distance points. And uh, they can definitely do it though. They need to get these pills to Steven. Did find another shot in the trailer as well. Not bad. Nirvana going to shoot up. Uh, they do have a charger now with this hit, so they can get a lot of damage right here. It's gonna be up to Holodala to make this map. They've got an another 100 distance points they can get. Plus, they've got about 100 health bonus points waiting for them in the safe room. Looks like they're gonna wait out the storm right here. Probably a good idea. Yeah, they can't exactly just power through the horde, but... I don't really see the horde either, so maybe they could have. I would have booked it. It's like the worst spot to stay. Smoker pre-spawning in the back. Briz getting some punches. Incapping Rook in the front and then getting out of there with really high out. Oh, he oh, goes nice. in the chart. But the two cap and back actually getting cleared, so the survivor's still alive. Yeah, they barely made this map. Yeah, they should be able to get these pickups and get into safe room. Help bonus. One, 
attack the door, I think. Maybe. Pumpfulness at 88. Yeah, but I mean, then they could just walk in instead of going for charger levels and uh, yeah. be fine. <laughs> no, but they're getting caught up on some horde here, so Spit's gonna go in to try to slow him down. Spit is gonna land, but Survivor's moving through it, booing themselves out of Spit. Pounce going in, getting dead stopped, and they shut the door on the SI. 72 point. Um, good job keeping yourselves alive. But, you know, mostly that was just uh, really nice playing by El Gigante on their Survivor side for this map. It's uh, just a 500 point deficit here for map 4, so, I mean, they can still come back from this. Yeah, that's pretty small for a uh, map 4 gap. I mean, just the other day I was watching, uh, was it a scrim or was it this match where, uh, didn't this team come back on Hard Rain 4 already in this tournament? I don't... No, I didn't watch their last match. In before, so. none of our casters watched that amazing <laughs> match that everybody told us about. Um, but yeah, basically, Holodala was down like 1,200 points. No, it was the Parish. It was the Parish. They were down like 1,200 points going into Parish finale, and they got like 1,600 points or something on the finale. Wow. And managed to win it like a giant TSW comeback. And that was the hard-to-kill game, right? Well, I like that. Yeah, that was the hard to kill versus Hollow Dollar game. So, and uh, you know, this is another comeback map four. So Hollow Dollar might be ready to take another one, but yeah, El Gigante has to play the map first, and if they make it here, it'll be really hard for Hollow Dollar to get a good comeback. I don't know, yeah. we'll have to see. They could make it with a low health bonus or something and get blown away. So we really won't know the winner of this until the, the second half of this, I'd say. Or who gets the tank. The <laughs> breaker's gonna call the match as soon as somebody gets the tank and be like, oh yeah, this is a wipe. <laughs> I know it. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for Nirvana to ready up once again. Such long pause between each round, wow. And there we he go. is ready. Reloading. Maybe they're strategizing their SI. Or calculating some scores. Hunter, go for DP! Ugh! Nope, nope, nope. Uh, three one with Boomer right here. Hunter pre spawning. Just gonna clear out Horde here. I don't know if this charge is gonna be able to get that spawn. Yeah, he's already blocked. Smoker. Oh, he does get the spawn eventually. Pull does land. Charger and Hunter both getting devastated right there. Mostly the Charger. Um, fourteen. Pull damage only me. But pretty nice shutdowns on everything else I have to say. Yeah, they have two shotguns, an Uzi, and a sniper. Reloading. So they only have one gun for slowdown. Interesting weapon loadout. Indeed. And of course, oh, tank is spawned up into the hands of Dusty. Um, let's do a hollow dollar war room immediately. Maybe go for pull downs here in a second. Um, nah, just if he gets a card near and you see an opportunity, you can call it out. Otherwise, it's just okay. like hit, maybe like hit one or two cards up there, and once he gets a 4K, just go in. Like, yeah. Cards too much. Hundred percent rage. You gonna go in dust? It's up to you. Okay. Ready. Nice. Let him pull him, maybe. Oh, I got played to the wall. Oh fuck. He's clear. Damn that guy, Dusty. Well, there's the other downed guy. Where's the other downed guy? 
Yeah, he could have. Welcome back, everyone. And that was Holodella's tank. Wow, look, he was going to get so killed so quickly there, but he stayed alive with 256 health. Uh, survivor's trying to get clears instead of shooting him down. So, um, El Gigante has two end caps, two and a half end caps out already. Their health was 616, which is pretty sizable, but, um, Paul Abdullah could chip him down some more. And still have room for a comeback. We have a great choke coming up right here, and then another one later in the map, so there's still two really good attacks left. Yeah, and of course, with survivors getting a uh, water slowdown, any of these choke points can be deadly if you get the right caps. You know, I think they should really just focus on getting a charge spit onto the health bonus. Two great health bonus players, both of them sitting in the back right now. One of them is Snutter too. But wow, they just completely missed that choke point. Okay, yeah. wow. Charger gonna spawn up in the front. Pole not gonna land. Charger not gonna land. And uh, Hunter gonna land for a split second. Everything coming from behind, and they just completely missed the choke point. Yeah, that was uh, that's not what they needed to do at this point. Stealing my strengths. I think with that late death, they're gonna be able to make it through this choke point actually with no attack. Yeah, they'll make it. They'll rush their attack. No. Glorious is gonna rest. come in right here around the fence. And one boom onto Puffery. They should stand there. Jockey for spawning. Charger needs to get in. They need to distract with this charge really hard. The charger not really in a great position. Oh wow! Oh. Whipping that charge onto Briz. They get a punch onto him, and I believe they got some chip onto Audio as well. The Audio was jockeying for a little bit, and they got another punch on the base, so... So, they've taken down another 100 points off the health bonus. But it's gonna be tough for them to make a comeback at this point. I'll have to do some calculating after they make it into safe room. Hunter going for some distracts right here, not really working. Oh, Coach blocking himself off in that safe room. Not going to land any caps on the health bonus, it looks like. Pull does land on the puff, gets cleared, and nice pick onto that jockey from Briz. It's a really nice shot on that jockey. Yeah. 468 health bonus. El Gigante now sitting at 3624 to 1955. The max score for this map should be 2100. So I suppose it is possible for them to win, but they need to ace this tank, basically. What was, uh, what was El Gigante's score? I think they were 501 points they ahead. Were I think they were exactly 500 points ahead before this round, so... Oh, yeah. Huh. So, I mean, it's possible. They need they need a thousand bonus, though, pretty much, so... I mean, that's, yeah. that's a lot. Man, the whole place is I mean, you have to completely ace this tank here, and then shut down the rest of the attacks through the whole map. To get that kind of bonus. Yeah, they're gonna have to be very cautious here. Looks like they're gonna take three Uzis. For at least the opening here. Just taking their time picking off as many common as they can. Hunter, Charger, both spawning up. Hunter's gonna land, Charger whips though, and pull not gonna land. Oh, actually does get another pull. Punch is going in under work, two of them. They need to be a bit more careful with their health bonus than that. Looks like the Charger punches. <laughs> he also he likes the sack the tank. <laughs> I've been Quick <told>. school <laughs> of tanking. First rule of the Charger is, you don't need it, so you should just get rid of it. Oh no, tank. Anyway, El Gigante now has the tank in the hands of Sheriff Shade, so let's take it to their war room. That's, That's right. That's right in front of you. 
I'm gonna this hit these two guys in the middle okay. of the street and this one inside. Go in. Okay, then go. Let me try this ball. No, just go in with your tank. Let's go. You need punches, just. Yeah. You don't ever just. Tell us when to go. You need that boom now. Reloading! I can't see shit! Stop him. Come on, help him. Good pounds, nice. That's a lot. Hit the boom guy, he's gonna clear. One more. Smoke is slow. Mix down. Go back. He's dead. If you, they try to get him up to a jump rock. Yeah. Nice shard. I'm gonna hit him. Oh, too far. Audio, you ready to hit? What's up? Go, go, go. Nice tank, man. Good boom. Ah! R2, if you're listening, I'm very, very sorry. I love you, R2. Fever likes man. Oh, you gotta do it. I'm pulling this guy. Good. Actually, no, they're together. They? No, he's, he's alone. Fucking faggot. I'm reloading. Oh, welcome back, everyone. And that was a very nice tank by Briz. Um, survivors basically just running at this point to get some distance. It is funny. Oh, oh, oh yeah, Charge is going to land on the Dusty in front. That's so that's pretty much it. Yeah, it was funny. While we were in that war room, uh, the tank passed to Briz, and he gets a car up on the roof, and Breaker calls GG right there. He's like, oh, this is a wipe. Uh, like he said, calling it out as soon as he sees who gets tank. And uh, he was right. The survivors juked around the tank pretty well for a while. But, you know, I really think they should have just dropped off the roof instead of trying to continue to juke on that rooftop. Tank managed to get some great separation and multi-caps one in. Oh, and, uh, that was it. Yeah, they did have the boom on one survivor. Who got punched by the tank, of course. For, like, an in-cap. Or close to it. Rook and Nirvana doing a two-man last stand. And it looks like it's... Well, actually managed to shut down the number of the SI, but walking this fit instead. Good games. El Gigante gonna win the tournament here. Commiserations to uh, Holodala, but it was a good run. Yeah, it was really close until the last uh, round there. It's just unfortunate that the victory couldn't be shared with R2. <laughs> Poor R2. 36-24 to 2383. Congrats, and uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the well next done. weekend tournament. See ya.